All right, let's continue. The list really left off where I said purple. Stormy Palace was one of my favorite albums. Don't you buy Storm Temple Pilots? It's a great, it's a great album. Okay, the next uh, next band is Chester Tull, and I, I have to choose one by Chester Tull. It'd probably be like, probably be Aqualong or War Child. Those are like really, both really good albums, you know, like shorter songs. Chester Tull is kind of a progressive rock band, you know. So they have like a lot of albums like Minister in the Gallery and and uh, and uh, Passion Play, which are long uh, songs, you know, kind of like, uh, but I don't really. Those aren't really my favorites. I like Take the Brick, you know, Aquila, War Child, Songs from the Wood, and Heavy Horses. Those are probably my favorite ones from Death Circle. So it's like, choose one of those. It's like, they're all great. You know, but I would go with like War Child or Aquila. If I had to choose my favorite. And of course, next band is Rush. And if I had to choose one album, that's probably my favorite. It's probably Moving Pictures. I see the album with uh, Tom Sawyer. Desert outside, I have said. I gotta get tired of listening to that song. I said, Desert on you, and the space is very deep. It's by on you. I said, Red Bot Shadow. Living in the limelight, the universe dream for those who wish they. Those who wish. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, so yeah. Great album. So he's like, Signals is also great because it has like, um, Subdivision song. Which is very little bit. But, uh, yeah, by, by Moving Pictures is probably, I think, their best album. And of course, it's Elvis Costello. And of course, this year's model is probably, is probably my favorite. The first album ever by Elvis Costello that I got was, uh, was Spike. But, you know.